Who is faster, Batman or The Flash? So oh, Mick. Uh, I I think the, the Flash is really, isn't he? Batman doesn't have any superpowers. He just mm. has fast gadgets and cars and things. Yeah, he's and very fast mind. Lightning-like reactions. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Killian, what about when you dressed as a woman in Breakfast on Pluto? Did you enjoy the experience? I thoroughly enjoyed it, yeah. I really got into my grooming. <laughs> uh, question for Killian: Hawken or Hawkins? I'm not quite sure what that means. That's uh, yeah, that's uh, from intermission, and I think it's. Oh, is this by Stephen Hawken? <laughs> yeah, that's right. It's, Arguing with it's Hawking, is it? Yeah. Oh, well, okay. Uh, oh, sweet Jesus, Killian Murphy, Butte. It's not a question, just a statement. But I figured I'd read it out to you. Um, do you keep your accent on set? Y- yeah, I do. Yeah, yeah. I don't. I don't. I don't stay in character or any of that. No. What do you think of actors who do that? I think whatever you know, whatever you need to do. Uh, uh, I just, I, I just keep forgetting. <laughs> <laughs> uh, a lot of people are asking, and we're not going to speak about the remarkable resemblance between Dermot and Killian. Now, obviously, you two are friends. You also look remarkably alike. So I think it's only fair that we should take some pictures and put them up on the website. Okay. All right. And uh, well, uh, in one, on one occasion, at one of your events after a movie, <laughs> a woman came up and went to me and went, "Oh my God, I think you're so brilliant. I love all your films." And I went, "Actually, I'm not Killian Murphy." And then I was like, "Damn, I am Killian Murphy, um, and I'm staying in room 605 in Shelburne. No pressure." Uh, Killian, again, it's not a question, but I called my son Killian after Killian Murphy. Can you ask him to say hello to Killian Hurley? Uh, he loves the wind that shakes the barley. Oh, that's really, really nice. Hello, Killian Hurley. So that's do I. I love that movie. I think oh, that's it's yours. Absolutely brilliant. That's a very, that's a very nice thing to hear. Killian, it sounds like you so don't want to be here, and us making you do a crow noise. Is that true? Says Shirley and Tala. I just, I've limited ability to do animals. <laughs> <laughs> no. I think you did a very impressive crow. Uh, will Killian be doing any more movies with Danny Boyle? Says <laughs> from Tom in Walkinstown. Uh, I'd love to work with Danny again. Um, uh, I guess you just you know if the right if the right material comes along and uh, it might happen I don't know you just uh, you think he's doing a film at the moment actually but uh, you never know Can I ask you one final question is there I know you've probably been asked a million times is there any one actor that you'd love to do a movie with <sighs> Yeah Someone said this is your last movie pick your cast who would you, who would you go for uh, There's so many uh, but I suppose because because I was watching the the rerun of the Oscars last night and it was so brilliant to see Jeff Bridges win you know, and uh, I've admired him for years, so it'd be fantastic to get to work with him. And I know people have worked with him and said he's just really amazing to work with. Cool, um, but that's just because he's, at, you know, I'm just so thinking about him. Me, I'm not not some someone you'd want because we've worked together, man. I'm uh, just about to star in a Jacob's Fig Rolls commercial. <laughs> this uh, is true. He uh, is. Has to uh, play the role of a taste bud. <laughs> Uh, that's coming out soon, so fine. He didn't pick me; he chose Jeff Bridges. But he he hasn't been asked to play a figure. Role at any point. No, he hasn't, and there's a reason for that. Uh, Killian, thanks a million, man. Thanks, lads.